How is it going guys? Drew Peacock here back with another video and thank the Lord Almighty the rain has finally gone. We can finally go out and drive our cars at least for the weekend. I believe it's supposed to come back on Monday which kind of sucks but at least for the weekend we have some nice clear skies, some beautiful weather here. So today we're going to take the Mustang out to a car meet and uh, we're going to go with the usual crew. We're going to go with no lift shift Alex um, with his SC300. They both got their cars back up and running and they're both breaking them in ironically so we're the only car that actually can do poles and stuff like that but we'll see if there's a couple people trying to play around you know I haven't stretched the old girl's legs in quite some time so I'm all down for it as long as it's safe and it's clear old girl here has been a little upset I haven't been giving her no attention she's just been sitting um, so I'll go ahead and uh, show her off on this brand new 4k camera that way you guys can see just how beautiful and how slightly dirty she is I did wash her yesterday and immediately after I washed her it started to drizzle just barely so she's a little wet I'm debating on just doing a quick wash before tonight but it really doesn't matter it's a night meet most of the cars that show up are ship boxes anyway so a little dirty 900 horsepower Mustang <laughs> nobody's gonna care Yes, I know I gotta fix the bumper. I'm actually talking to a paint guy right now and we're just trying to line up a date, but that will be fixed. Um, I was trying to source a new bumper for the longest time, but it's just not really possible. It seems like this bumper is just discontinued. You can't get it. So we're just going to patch it and blend it and it'll be good as new. But yeah, so for now we're just waiting on Brian to pull up and then he's actually dropping off his IS because I'm gonna do some body work on it over the weekend. And then we're gonna go get his Mustang and head to the meet and have some fun. I mean, the last meet I went to, it was raining, which kind of sucked. So it'll be interesting to see what kind of cars come out now that everyone can finally drive their cars there should be some pretty good stuff not just the typical garbage that is usually expected of socal car meets so we'll just hang out until everyone shows up and then we'll head out really quickly though i do just want to mention if you are someone that gets upset that i crack jokes at like people's cars and stuff like that don't take it to heart it's not that serious i'm just having some fun i know a lot of these cars aren't done and that kind of stuff and like the owner is still working on them but we got to learn to laugh at ourselves i mean i've had the same busted ass front end on this Mustang forever and one can argue oh Drew did you did you hit a crowd did you hit a crowd and I really wouldn't care so just lighten up it's not that serious I'm not making fun of their mama or anything like that it's a car okay it's a car a lot of people say Drew that's an extension of themselves that car they're expressing themselves man you're being rude and to that I have to say you guys have no problem making fun of all of these music artists when their music sucks dick but that's an extension of themselves they're expressing themselves but you guys get offended at a fucking piece of metal grow up now let's go have some fun all right let's annoy the neighbors one more time before they go to bed believe it or not it's actually nighttime this camera just kicks ass that and i don't really have the settings dialed in so let's see ah uh, that wasn't so bad Alright guys, we made it to the meet and it's an absolute banger. Like, as you can tell, it's just wild. The cops are everywhere. It's... it's I, don't, I don't know where the meet's at. <laughs> I mean, we haven't been to one of these, like, Tuner Friday meets in forever. Dude, um, it's a movie. It's a movie out here. I think, uh, I think TJ Hunt's supposed to come. I think a Stradman's <laughs> on his way somewhere. Uh, the dude in blue is on his way. I think it's, it's, it's coming in from wherever he's Paul from. Paul Walker is probably gonna make oh, an appearance. Gonna make yeah, I mean it's 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 a movie. Yeah, so I mean, I guess we'll show you the two uh, only cool cars here so far. We got uh, the I don't know what what I don't even have a name for it. Do I? I I've never named it. I don't want to. No. I've got the three valve, and this thing is back from retirement. You guys saw it a couple weeks ago, but he is almost done breaking in his motor and then all he has to do is do exhaust and fuel and he can actually utilize the built Gen 2 Coyote that he now has. What are we thinking, 1500? Yeah, right. <laughs> so um, with the rain though, and since he's breaking it in, he's on his uh, street tires, his RTRs, which look nice, you know, it looks like no one's gonna fuck with him. So that's good and it'll help him stay off the throttle because 
he doesn't want to. 80 rolls only. Yeah, 80 <laughs> rolls only. He doesn't want to break it. Um, oh, is that Alex right there? Yeah, that's Alex. Looks like Alex. We'll get Alex pulling up. He just put a T56 in his car, as in I just helped him put a T56 in his car because he was stuck for a week. Um, so he's supposedly loving it, but he's breaking his shit in too. So a lot of people breaking their shit and breaking it in. I have a broken Honda. You have not breaking broken, in motor. but breaking in motor. And he had a broken trans and... Now he's breaking it in, yeah, breaking in the clutch and the and the trans. His power steering is so loud. You got a supercharger under there? It sounds like it. So you guys have seen this car a million times, but it's a 1.5 JZ. Hey, have him back up. He's sticking out. 1.5 JZ single turbo, 650 wheel horsepower. Absolute monster, you know. But uh, yeah, with his T56 now, I'm telling him to turn it up, but we'll see. I know he's uh, he likes it safe. He likes it real safe. I mean, I'm huh? how, how do you like the T56? You can hear it right now. I don't hear shit. I hear your exhaust, and I feel your heater. I don't hear anything. I guess you can't really hear it that much. It sounds quiet as hell. Maybe I'll go for a ride with you really quick, and then, we, um, well, I guess not. <laughs> I was going to say we'll go for a ride with him really quick and see if we could hear it, because he's claiming that his T56 is making a lot of noise, which isn't normal. Um, well, uh, some noise is normal, I will say. My Super does make some noise, and that is 100% normal, but he's claiming it's, like, ridiculous, and so I don't believe it. I think he's just being a drama queen, um, so maybe we'll go for a ride. All right, so we are going to go for a ride really quick. Um, he can't get on it, so we're not doing any pulls, but we can see if he's complaining about nothing oh god your seats are aggressive all right let's see if we can hear it uh would it be louder with the windows up yeah okay that's your fuel pump though that whining that whining is my fuel pump yeah okay because yeah he is, his fuel tank is like literally right there like yeah yeah, I, yeah that's, fuel pump. that's when you when you sent me the video originally i thought yeah, that's what you were talking hear, about yeah. and i was like mine doesn't make that noise but jesus christ no, don't do a full pull, please. Cause I should have went for that. You definitely should have. You totally missed out. That guy is far away. Oh, I thought he was still down there. I didn't see him. No. I was like, um, I probably could still go. All right, you're good now. I think it's it's solid. I, I like how it's not doing it when you're here. You smell that? You smell the E? I do smell the E, yeah. yeah no, I, th I think literally the noises you're hearing are normal, so I wouldn't stress it. All right, so now that we know that Alex is crazy, good for him because his T56 is working perfectly, so he's pretty much ready to turn it up. Come on, we want to see 700 out of it. Turn it up. Um, but yeah, no, that's good. So uh, it's starting to sort of get crowd up. I mean, we got a welded diff on a Z right there. We got a couple Subies out there. Um, so it's cars are coming slowly, so we'll just wait till more come and then we'll do a lap. Hey, what are you doing in the car with my girl? Run. Yeah, can't wait to see it blow up again. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <Fuck yeah. laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> dude, why'd you have to copy me? Some dude named Drew Peacock well, told me to do so. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you want to start winning races, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that shit's whack. You can't even see it, can you? Yeah, you can see it. Oh, this camera's badass. I upgraded. Oh, that's a new one, huh? Yeah, that's a new one. So, you can see everything like clear as day. I can see it better in the lens than in person. Like, I can actually, I can't see your, like, belt and shit, but I can see it in the camera. We'll eat that shit up. Line that bitch up. Hey, we could beat that, and you guys don't even gotta, like, stress anything. I know. <laughs> you guys could beat it without technically going out of the the terms of your don't, braking don't period don't 4k rpm 4k rpm <laughs> shifting yeah just you know granny shifting not double clutching you know <laughs> thanks brian i mean we're laughing at him but we don't have a ferrari so <laughs> <laughs> we're the real <laughs> losers here <laughs> Oh, you got a McLaren, so... I, mean, I do have a McLaren. Yeah. Where does the real... But, I, but, but I don't have a Ferrari, though, is what I'm saying. Yeah. You know? <laughs> Ferrari is a Ferrari. All right, we got RSX with the hood popped. Hey, is that the Datsun you were talking about? No, it's not the one. Oh, okay. He said there was a cool Datsun coming, but apparently that ain't it. Dude! Damn! Dude, he really did that. He really did... He, wow, that's a... 
crazy build. He got the aftermarket oil cap. He's got more chrome <laughs> than me. <laughs> he does have more chrome than you, buddy. Um, sweet. Yeah. All right, I wasted enough Look of my time. That. That's it. <laughs> oh wow, how kind of him. Yeah, he put a he put a bucket in the passenger side to make sure his passenger doesn't get tossed around. Atta boy. I mean, there's some okay cars here. We got an old. That's a first gen Integra, right? Yeah. Yeah, first gen Integra, which looks like an old Camry. SC400. He's got tri-spoke wheels. The 400, which means he has 100 more horsepower than you, because you have a 300. That's what it means, right? I wish no. it worked. <laughs> All right, let's see what's come. Let's see uh, what's here. Type R, don't look half bad. Is that stock Honda wheels? They are? Wow, Honda made a decent looking set of wheels for once. Look at that, Cosmos on the Veloster wide body. Damn, this thing is fucking thick. They don't look the same. Carbon hood. Hey, at least he has his carbon hood. You don't got a carbon yeah. hood. Dude, that shit is thick. Obviously on air suspension. I'm not a huge... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, he still has his bumper intact, so we can tell he's not static. Uh, no, I mean, honestly, for like a stance car, I mean, I'm not... Oh, you guys know I'm not a huge fan of him, but... I mean, he did it right. Definitely did it right. I like it. All right, here's that Shelby. Um... Uh, I, mean, I see I see a Shelby badge. I think it's a, it's a Shelby. <laughs> no, it's a Shelby, bro. No, it's a Shelby. Dude, he's got a... Wait, I could see the V6 underneath the hood. All right, all right, get out of here, get out of here. I can see it. VIP'd, aired out or static? That's definitely static. You think that's definitely static? I don't know. This is way too low. Well, dude, his rim is bent, so it, it might be, it might be static. That shit is fucking slammed. Like, it, like it looks gangster. I'm happy it doesn't have too much camber. You, right you're like here. wet over this? I mean, I, I can't, I really can't tell if you're being sarcastic or not. Serious. You're serious. Oh yeah, this thing's like so ratchet to toss him. It's so ratchet to toss him. It's a backhanded compliment, you know that, right? Yeah, I know. It's like spitting in someone's face and saying, you're welcome, you know? No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, it's not bad. Again, like, for it being a stamps car, I don't hate I've it. I always wanted an LS400. You want a big body? I want a big body. You want a big booty? Oh yeah. <laughs> Might need a bigger seat. <laughs> <laughs> like I don't hate it, but like I wouldn't drive it, you know? Like it's again, it's just not my style. Damn dude, look how low look at how low the back bumper is. Holy shit. Dude, there's no fucking way. <laughs> yeah, you're fucking around. <laughs> I knew it. Yeah, dude, that shit is like literally like that okay, I like it that it's on air then. That's cooler. I thought it was like a legit static, but no, that's that's cool. The body actually is straight. I'm not gonna lie, it's in really good condition for it being like slammed. But yeah, the body is really straight. Damn. Whatever grandma he got this off of, she really did not drive this shit. All right, cool. All right, we got a couple Subies. I believe those are XXRs. All right. If I had to choose, if I had to choose, I'm choosing the blue one. Oh no, I don't know actually. The blob is kind of nice. I, I mean, I, I like wagons, but if this wasn't a wagon. I don't know. I like the Hawkeyes better. Yeah, I like the Hawkeyes. I like it because of Baby Driver. I'm sorry, but <laughs> that's why I like it. But because it's a wagon and it's on a, <coughs> it's on reps. Uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I mean, uh, the wagon, I just like them better as a sedan um, for, for the Hawkeyes. The blob eye though, the blob eye is really clean. I actually like the blob eye. The white and gold actually looks really clean. The body and the paint looks great. I actually like it. That's actually one of my favorite cars here so far. All right, awesome. Love this one. Fire for reasons that don't need to be stated. It's the best build here. I see an intercooler and a cage. Damn. Precision Dynamics on the <coughs> 335i. A few beamers here, actually. All right, we're gonna grab some in and out and hopefully by the time we come back, there's more cars here. So, fingers crossed. All right, so the meat looks Look a little bit Civic. more crowded. We got a Civic, it's a With Type R. Anime. Of the anime wrap with the hood pop. Still a question. We got the M3 leaving, and it sounds beautiful. Yeah, I think that's a Volvo with a hood pop. Let's see the let's see the Type R. Let's check it out. Let's see what he's got cooking. All right. Intake. Yeah, intake. Uh, another oil cap. Um, radium. What is this? A power steering? Is this power steering or coolant? Coolant. I never knew that made stuff. Me neither. What kind of oil do you think he uses? Uh, probably <laughs> what kind of oil? I don't know. It's a, probably a Lucas. I want to use what? Uh, <laughs> I want to see the wrap though. One second. Is it full? 
Dude, that M3 sounds so nice. That one. Do you think it's DCT? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's just, yeah, that's pretty smooth. The, the it sounds were too crisp yeah. for it to be. If not, then an my hat's off to you. Okay, I don't know what this is. Alrighty then. Yeah, moving on. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck it is, so let's go. All right, Mammy, are we ever coming to this meet again? This shit is dead. Oh, there's that, uh, there's that uh, Subi leaving, the blah by. Brian, remind me to never listen to Alex and come out to one of these trash ass meets again. God, that is annoying. Hey, you shut the fuck up over there. How about that? Bleep. <laughs> I could have beat my meat and that would have been more entertaining than this. Yeah. I could have had you guys watch. No. <laughs> that would have been entertaining. That would have been more entertaining than this. <laughs> All right, well, we're getting ready to head out. It is dead. The, the meat's not getting any better, so we'll get a, a cold start. So we've been here so long, waiting for people to pull up. Anything cool? No. I mean, like, there's people on e-bikes here, man. Like, that is the most interesting thing, is fucking high schoolers on e-bikes. 